Daniels from Tech Stuff 31 and today I'm going to show you how to add your fingerprint to Touch ID. Now, uh, Touch ID is um, a new feature for the iPhone 5S, 6, 6 Plus and the new iPad family. Um, it allows you to log into your phone, um, pay for purchases, and pay for stuff on iTunes with your fingerprint. So it basically allows um, much higher security than uh, with just a normal combination and um, it's a really cool feature that you can unlock really easily. So the way you do this is um, I have the iPhone 6 here. You go in and you log in normally if you haven't set it up yet and you go into settings. Okay and when you're in settings it will be up at the top like this but you'll just scroll down a little bit and you'll see touch ID and passcode. Now this is the place you want to go to, so you're just going to tap that. And if you already have a passcode, you're going to enter it now. If you haven't, then they'll have you set it up currently. So you'll do that. And now once in here, you'll see a whole bunch of stuff. But what you really want to be looking for is add a finger, add a fingerprint. So that's what we want to be looking for. Uh, I'm going to hit add a fingerprint, and now it's going to take you through the whole process. So it tells you to put your thumb on the, the keypad, so that's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to, and you will hear it vibrate, and when it vibrates, you will pick your thumb up. You hold your thumb down until you feel that vibration. Okay, so now it's saying adjust your grip. So I'm going to pick up my phone now because this is the grip that I would be using if I was ever holding my phone. So this is a little bit of a different grip. I'm just going to be going like this. You continue and you just move your thumb around in sort of a circular motion. So you can get all the possible grips. And remember, you don't pick your thumb up until you feel that vibration. And now it says complete and you hit continue. So something interesting I discovered was if I entered one thumb on one finger, the other thumb on the other finger would not work. And um, this may just be more specific to me, or this may happen to other people, I'm not quite sure. But um, if you find that only one thumb is working, you will um, obviously need to repeat the step with your other thumb. And if you want to use, if, or if you typically use other fingers to hit the home button, you can also add those. Okay guys, so hopefully this was a helpful video to you. I'll just show you. It works. Um, it's a pretty cool feature. Um, I really like it. And um, it really uh, makes the phone a lot easier to use and a lot quicker to use when opening it up. Okay guys, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And um, I'll see you in the next video.